Hi ladies. As you can tell, I have laid out some um, stones and I am, somebody asked me to show them how I did the brush. So this is it so far. I'm using black stones, pink stones, and diamonds, okay? I've got this much further to go. This, as you can tell, was the clear Sally's brush, okay? And the stones I got off of eBay or Amazon, I just typed in uh, AB stones, nail stones, okay? So, what I'll be using is a toothpick, hold on, just a regular toothpick for the glue, and um, some pointy tweezers, okay? So, let me lay that there. And I'm going to lay some glue out, some of the E6000 glue. And I'm just, you can only do this a little bit at a time, ladies, because the glue dries so fast. Um, the, glue, the glue dries really, really fast. So, I'm trying to put this in a position where you guys can see it. I'm going to get me a little bit of glue on my toothpick. And this isn't in any specific order. I'm just putting the stones as, you know, as I, as they fit, I guess. So, I'm just going to lay the glue here. Okay. You can see that. And I'm going to start picking up stones. I'm going to get me a pink one. And lay it here. I'm going to grab a black one. And put it here. Okay, and in between that, I'm just going to pick up some of the clear, the tiny nail stones. i just put them in between. Okay, and you can put a couple at a time, two or three, that's what I do. I put two or three at a, at a, at a, at a time, sorry. I don't know why every time I do a video, it's like I stutter or something still a little nervous not used to doing tutorials but okay there you go and then you just keep adding a little bit of glue at a time so I'm gonna put a little bit more over here and just continue it's really not that hard it's just um, very very time-consuming I guess you could say yeah, it's more time consuming than anything. Not that it's a bad thing be because you'll have a really pretty brush when you get finished and and you did it, you know. It'll be it's your creation. So I'm just picking up stones and putting them in between where there are spaces, okay? And now I have to drop this and pick up some more. I have to pour out some more glue. And I'm pouring it on this uh, bootleg DVD case because I really don't use the case anyway. Somebody broke the movie, scratched it up, whatnot. So it's just a movie case. And I just put a little dab on the movie case. Use the toothpick. And just apply apply glue see apply, apply some glue and then the stones I'm gonna put some more um, clear ones over here oh, I'm so sorry you guys okay I'm gonna add these black ones are really really pretty too especially with this pink the pink stones sometimes you'll pick up more than one it's okay just place it and keep going oh, that one don't want to stick okay and then just some more little stones in between there and it's really not easy to do it doing a tutorial because you have to look really close sorry you have to look really close to make sure you don't have a space between because you'll be able to definitely definitely see it okay so I'm throwing a couple stones there and 
Here it is. I mean, you can do whatever you want to with it. I really wasn't expecting to do another brush, but I mean, if you guys ask me to do something, if if I can, I I will. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. It's not really that big of a deal. It's not that hard. It's just very, very time consuming. That's all. So, as you're laying down glue, you just pick up a stone, place it. I'm going to pick up some smaller pink ones, I think. And just put one over here. Yeah. Just wherever I find a little space. Um, here I'm going to put... Oops. Oh, I hate when that happens. When they flip over on you. Okay, I'm just going to put this one here. So, then I'm going to need some more clear ones. And it, I mean, you can maneuver the glue around a little while. I mean, it dries fast on, I mean, it really does dry fast, but I mean, you still have a little bit of working time with it while you're doing this. Okay. So it's not like it's going to instantly dry. And that's it. I mean, you guys get the idea. And I guess that's to prove I made my own brush and didn't have somebody else make it for me. This is the this is the how to bling out your own brush, okay? So I hope this was helpful and um I hope you guys enjoy this brush. It's a little bit different than the other one. And um Till next video, thanks for watching.